and welcome to today's virtual singing session with the Diocese of Leeds Schools Singing Programme. We're going to start with a silly song. In fact, as Alex described it a few weeks ago, it's a very silly song. It's the crocodile. If you know it, make sure that you sing along in your head when we start missing out the animals. If you don't know it, it's very easy to pick up, so join in as much as you can. There was a crocodile and a orangutan, a flying eagle and a silvery fish, a bunny, a beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. There was a an orangutan, a flying eagle and a silvery fish, a bunny, a beaver. A crazy elephant. Na 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 na. There was a a flying eagle and a silvery fish. A bunny, a beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. There was a and a silvery fish. A bunny. A beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. There was a a bunny, a beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. There was a. A beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. There was a a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. All the animals. There was a crocodile, an orangutan, a flying eagle, and a silvery fish. A bunny, a beaver, a crazy elephant. Na 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 na. Standing really tall, do a great big face. Scrunched up, then really big, scrunch. Terrifying. Your turn. One more. And now throw supersonic darts. Bow, 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 bow. And remember to do that as high pitched as you can. Let's do two more sets of those. So here come the first one. Make sure you're throwing over your head and feeling that arc of sounds. Two, three, and go. Bow, bow, bow. And one more, standing lovely and tall, really relaxed here. Two, three, and go. Bow, bow. Well done. We're going to continue our warm-up using the piano, so I'm just going to teleport in that direction very quickly. I love watching the bees in our garden, so let's buzz like bees, remembering to use your tummy muscles to help this sound. And while we do that, here are some shots of actual bees on actual flowers in our garden earlier this week. And off we go. And our last one. Now we're going to play tennis with this Alleluia. So I'll sing it and you hit it straight back to me. Who will win? I bet it will be you. Alleluia. Your turn. Alleluia. Alleluia. Your turn. Alleluia. Alleluia. Your 
Schultern. Alleluia. On Trinity Sunday, we sing a special verse in the middle of this Alleluia. So let's do the whole thing. I'll sing the verse in the middle and join in with as much as you can. Did you remember to keep really tall nouns during that? This week's themes are the Holy Trinity, because on Sunday just gone, it was Trinity Sunday, and rhythm and duration. Sing back after me. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Your turn. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. My turn. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Your turn. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Bella mama, bella mama, bella mama, bella mama. Bella mama, bella mama, bella mama, bella mama. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Your turn. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Did you notice that the first and the last phrases were exactly the same? What I'd like you to do now is, when you sing it back after me, think about which of the phrases, the first, the second, the third, or the fourth, has a different ending. So we'll do exactly the same. I sing, you sing back. Here's the first phrase. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Your turn. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. My turn. Second phrase. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Let's go. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Third phrase. Bella mama, bella mama, bella mama, bella mama. Your turn. Bella mama, bella mama, bella mama, bella mama. And the last phrase. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Together. Bella mama, bella mama, yeah. Which of those had a different ending? If you're thinking it was the third phrase, then you're right. All the others had a long note at the end and if you remember from Alex's session yesterday, that note worth four beats is called a semi-breathe. No one really knows where this song comes from. We're going to sing it again and we're going to put the music along the bottom of the screen where the subtitles normally go. Follow that while you're singing and see if you can spot those semi-breathes, those notes that are worth four crotchet beats. And most importantly, make sure you hold them on for long enough. Stand nice and tall lovely relaxed face and mouth and keep counting the pulse. <laughs> Brilliant job of that counting. Well done. Here's a very imaginative song about looking after nature. It's called The Osprey and all the schools I go into love singing it so I'm sure you will too. The words and the music were written by children in a school in Oxfordshire in the south of England and it talks about how selfish the people who steal eggs from osprey nests are and it means it endangers 
those beautiful majestic birds. We'll see some pictures of those right at the end of this clip. Let's start by learning the chorus. If you know it already, join in with me. We'll do it twice. Take a good breath. Flying high, flying free. Osprey on the wind to ride. Flying high, flying free. Spread your wings so far and again. Flying high, flying free. Osprey on the wind you ride. Flying high, flying free. Spread your wings so far and wide. Now let's learn the verse and our voices are going to soar through the melody like the beautiful osprey gliding high in the sky. I'll sing it, you sing it back to me. In the land of heather and islands. Your turn. In the land of heather and islands, the osprey flies over the moors. The osprey flies over the moors. Scanning the hills for danger, scanning the hills for danger, as with speed he dives and soars, as with speed he dives and soars. Chorus, flying high, flying free, or spray on the wind you ride. Flying high, flying free, spread your wings so far and wide. The song's got three verses. We set up the scene of the beautiful osprey gliding in the sky. Then we introduce the egg collectors who are selfishly stealing the eggs from the nests of the ospreys. And then in the last verse, we have our message to the egg collectors. Don't do that. They don't belong to you. It's really, really selfish. So try and put a bit of that emotion into your singing. And we're going to do this song in a couple of weeks time. So don't worry if you can't join in with all of it now. Try your best. Here's a little introduction and we'll do all three verses. One, two, three. Flying high, flying free. Spray on the wind to ride, flying high, flying free. Spread your wings so far and wide in the land of heather and islands. The osprey flies over the moors, scanning the hills for danger. As with speed he dives and soars, flying high, flying free, or spray on the wind to ride, flying high, flying free, spread your wings so far and wide, in the land of cliffs and canyons. The egg collectors look, killing off those osprey chicks. That's their dirty work. Flying high, flying free. Osprey on the wind to ride. Flying high, flying free. Spread your wings so far and wide. Do not steal those osprey chicks. They don't belong to you. You've no right to take their lives and threaten freedom too. Flying high, flying free. Osprey on the wind to ride, flying high, flying free. Spread your wings so far and wide. 
Here are some pictures of that fabulous bird, the osprey. And also a little reminder about dotted notes and how the dot adds half of the value to the note it comes after. Lots of the notes at the end of phrases in the osprey were worth three beats. You'll have to look out for that next time we sing it. Which of these phrases has got a different rhythm? Say them back after me. Bubble gum, bubble gum, chew and blow. Bubble gum, bubble gum, chew and blow. Bubble gum, bubble gum on my toe. Bubble gum, bubble gum on my toe. Bubble gum, bubble gum, tastes so sweet. Bubble gum, bubble gum, tastes so sweet. Get that bubble gum off my feet. Get that bubble gum off my feet. So which one had a different rhythm? It was the last phrase because all the others start with the short notes, with the half beat notes. And the last phrase starts with one beat notes. Get that and then has the short ones. So this little rhyme has got half beat notes, bubble, remember they're called quavers. It's got one beat notes, chew and, which are called crotchets. And it's got two beat notes, blow and toe. Do we remember the actions for all of these? Bubble gum, bubble gum, chew and blow. Let's try putting it together. And a one, two, three and four. Bubble gum, bubble gum, chew and blow. Bubble gum, bubble gum on my toe. Bubble gum, bubble gum, tastes so sweet. Get that bubble gum off my feet and we'll do it really quickly this time. One, two, three and go. Bubble gum, bubble gum, chew and blow. Bubble gum, bubble gum on my toe. Bubble gum, bubble gum, tastes so sweet. Get that bubble gum off my feet. So remember, it's got half beat notes, quavers, one beat notes, crotchets, and two beat notes, minims. And this is how that looks when it's written out. On Trinity Sunday, we think about the mystery of the most holy trinity, God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. This is a really joyful song about all of God's creation praising him, and the words come from Psalm 148. Before we learn the words, let's just get the tune of the chorus. Sing back after me. Do, 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 do. do, do, do. of the earth, all the nations of the earth, praise the Lord who brings to birth, praise the Lord who brings to birth, the greatest star, the smallest flower, the greatest star, the smallest flower, hallelujah, hallelujah. I think we're ready to learn the verse as well. What I'd like you to do while we're doing this is sing it back after me, but also think about which word has a four beat note at the end. Remember those four beat notes called semi briefs? Which word ends with one of those each time? Let the heavens praise the Lord. Let the heavens praise the Lord. Alleluia. Alleluia. And stars praise the Lord. Moon and stars praise the Lord. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Which of those words had four beats at the end? It was Hallelujah, and it's the same in the chorus as well. We're going to sing three verses of the song now. If you want to sing the whole of it, 
it's in our collective worship playlist along with lots of other really beautiful and joyful songs. So here is three verses of this setting of Psalm 148, All the Nations of the Earth. All the nations of the earth praise the Lord who brings to birth the greatest of us all as far. Alleluia. Let the heavens praise the Lord. Alleluia. Moon and stars praise the Lord. Alleluia. All the nations of the earth praise the Lord who brings to birth the greatest star, the smallest flower. Alleluia. Snow capped mountains praise the Lord. Alleluia. Moon and stars praise the Lord. Alleluia. All the nations of the earth praise the Lord who brings to birth the greatest star, the smallest flower. Alleluia. Kings and princes praise the Lord. Alleluia. Young and old praise the Lord. Alleluia. All the nations of the earth praise the Lord who brings to birth the greatest star, the smallest flower. Alleluia. Well done. I hope you enjoyed learning that new song. It's nearly the end of today's session. We've just got time to fit in a bit of left luggage, which we started learning last week. So here's a little bit of revision. I left my luggage on the left hand side of the shelf on the left. Your turn. I left my luggage on the left hand side of the shelf on the left. In the left luggage office nearby. In the left luggage office nearby. It was right on the edge, right on the edge, right on the edge. It was right on the edge, right on the edge, right on the edge. Just left right there on the left hand side of the shelf on the left in the left luggage office nearby. Just left right there on the left hand side of the shelf on the left in the left luggage office nearby. I reckon you're getting the hang of this now. So to make it a bit harder, we're going to tap the pulse. I left my luggage on the left hand side. Well, that's pretty easy, you're thinking. But when we say left, we're going to tap with our left hand. And when we say right, we're going to have to tap with our right hand means you're going to have to think ahead a little bit. Now to make it easier, I'm going to do it like a mirror version of you. So when you use your left hand, I'm going to use my right hand and that will make it a little bit easier to copy. So let's try it fairly steadily so the tempo won't be too quick. One, two, three. I left my luggage on the left hand side of the shelf on the left in the left luggage office nearby. It was right on the edge, right on the edge, right on the edge, just left right there on the left hand side of the shelf, on the left, in the left luggage office nearby. That took me ages to learn. Do you want to try it really quickly? Just see what happens. Doesn't matter if it goes wrong. And remember, if you want to practice this one, you can always watch this clip again, rewind and watch this part of the session. Good luck everyone, or one, two, three. I left my luggage on the left hand side of the shelf, on the left in the left luggage office nearby. It was right on the edge, right on the edge, right on the edge, just left right there, on the left hand side of the shelf, on the left in the left luggage office nearby. Yeah, fantastic. So I've had a great time in this session. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope you've enjoyed the songs and activities. Thank you very much for joining us. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel if you haven't done already and share with your friends and family. 
Tomorrow, it's Friday Highlights, which was great last week. All the choral directors will be there, will be on the chat, so come and say hello. Be one of the first people to watch that at two o'clock tomorrow. And don't forget, there's a fantastic Key Stage 3 session with Will at three o'clock tomorrow afternoon. Thanks so much for joining us. See you next time. Bye.